Hi, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another video. I'm dressed very uh, appropriate for this uh, winter season that we're currently in, but basically I'm getting very excited about the possibility of me going to Bali in May and I know it might sound unlikely to you, um, sounds unlikely to me too. The possibility of me going to Bali in May is really getting me through. So I've just ordered loads of new clothes. Anyways, I know this is a really basic, I'm just following the trend, it's gonna take me about half an hour to film kind of video, I really apologize. I don't know, maybe some of you are interested in my camera roll, probably not, but uni is in full swing. It's, it's a lot of work and I really just don't have time. It's currently Saturday as I'm filming this and it's going up on Sunday morning, so I've got a lot to do today. But yeah, I do apologize. Anyway, we're doing the show me a photo of trend started on instagram i did it on instagram now it's on youtube i'm doing it on youtube oh my god you're so original Gemma. i'm gonna start with me on uni move-in day that feels like a lifetime ago firstly it also feels like 10 minutes ago yeah this is me on the first day of uni i actually vlogged it if you want to go watch it i was absolutely shitting bricks to be honest with you oh speaking of my mother the next question is show me a photo of all of your family um, I'm gonna see if I can find some baby photos, like when we're really little, so I'll include those and then also a more recent one. Right, let's get this out of the way, shall we? You absolutely smashed. Um, I had a lot of these. Let me see you drunk. You guys, I just threw you on the ground. Are you okay? I, oh, when was I the most drunk? I mean, that's not really the question, but I'm just trying to think. The only time I've ever been kicked out of a club, only ever happened once, was at Kirsty's 18th. We went to a toy room and I don't really remember anything, to be honest with you. I just remember getting escorted out by two men either side of me. I think I was like arguing with them because apparently when I'm drunk, I love to argue with people and I get really mouthy and... It's not good, is it? Actually, I might insert a video. I know this isn't that's not the trend, but I have a video of me in the car on the way back from a night out with Ellie and Summer and Jess. And I'm still convinced to this day that I got spiked. I was so drunk. I was so not good. Like sure, I'm gonna ask Summer because I'm sure she has a better photo of me drunk than I do. Whatever summer sends in because i'm sure it's a lot more flattering okay well slightly changing tune show me a photo of a breakdown i have so many of these they go way too many so i'll insert a few i could go for a very long time i cry a lot crying is my answer to everything even when i'm not really that upset about it i still cry it's really not good is it but anyway my lock screen it's just me and my two friends from uni, Shof and Ellie. I'm sure you know who they are. We went to London in the most beautiful restaurant in the entire world. Your favourite birthday? I think my favourite birthday has to be my 18th. I had a massive party, also got a vlog of that on my channel. Um, in my garden, it cost a lot of money. I it took a lot of planning. It was a good party, I'm not gonna lie. I thought it was a good party and all my best friends are there. I had like all my family friends, all my family, like everyone I knew was pretty much there, which obviously doesn't happen very regularly. So yeah, that was probably my best. My 20th one, <laughs> nothing. So that's not gonna compete, is it? My 19th was cute. I was in Budapest with my boyfriend at the time and that was really nice as well, but I'd had, my 18th definitely wins. Show me a photo of you five years ago. So five years ago, I would have been 15 years old. Uh, me at 15 wasn't pretty. Um, 15 year olds now look like models. Uh, me at 15, not quite there. Um, I'll insert some photos. That's my natural hair colour, by the way. I started bleaching my hair when I was either 15 or 16. Pretty sure it was 16. Don't let me go brunette again. Whatever anyone says, just don't let me do it. I'm just much happier when I'm blonde. Much happier. Something you hate. Um. <laughs> um. 
I hate cheese. Cheddar cheese, ugh, my worst nightmare. I absolutely despise it. Oh, also mashed potatoes. I'm terrified of mashed potatoes and roast potatoes and jacket potatoes. I need potato, really, so. No, I think that's it. Hate's a strong word and I will only attach it to those things. There's probably a lot more things I hate, let's be honest, but that's all I can think about right now, okay? Favourite photo of myself. I don't really like many photos of myself. Like, I'll like them initially and I'll post them on Instagram or my story or whatever. And then I'll look at them more than like three times and I'll hate them. So, I mean, maybe one of these, I don't know what I'm going to insert right now, but I probably won't like them in about 10 minutes. <laughs> right, there were so many. Show me your um, ex. I didn't show any photos of when we were together. And I'm not going to show one now because that would be really weird. So I'm really sorry um, to everyone who asked, but <laughs> that was a lot. Um, not going to happen. But here's one I took earlier. <clears throat> I'm kidding. The snow bad blood was a joke. I'm gonna get in trouble. A moment you felt proud of yourself. Hmm. Well, firstly, definitely the first day of uni, which obviously I've already put a photo of. And just honestly, the fact that I did that, I'm just very impressed with myself because I was not in a good place when I started uni. Me and my ex had broken up like less than two weeks before and I was a mess. I was distraught. <laughs> Let's just put it blatantly. Summer thought I was gonna drop out of uni. Like, I was a mess. Time is a, a wonderful healer. But yeah, it was really not good timing. So, thank you for that. So definitely that. Also, the day I uploaded this video, um, I don't know if I have any photos of myself from that day, but I bawled my eyes out. I just, the response was amazing from people I know, people I haven't spoken to in like eight years, you guys, people who just randomly found me on YouTube. I was terrified to film it. I was terrified, to, actually I couldn't edit it. I had to get someone to edit it because I couldn't watch it back without crying and it's not very productive. But yeah, it was rough, but I'm so glad I did it. I still get messages about it. Right, another sad one. Um, show me a photo of when you were sad, but no one knew. Uh, so we're gonna throw it back quite far for this one. I was probably, I don't know how old I would have been, 15. It was not a good time. There was a lot going on in my life, a lot more than a lot of 15 year olds can handle, a lot more than I could handle. It was very intense, there was a lot of people involved and it went on for a very long time. But no one really knew. Everyone found out eventually what was going on and how I was feeling and everything. Um, and I'm fine now, just in case anyone's worried. <laughs> but yeah, not a good time of my life and we're not ever gonna go back there. But it does put a lot of stuff in perspective, like whenever I'm sad now, um, or whenever I'm having a bad day or crying about something, or whatever, it's been worse. So is that the silver lining? Maybe. <laughs> your prom ah oh, this is a photo or two of me at my prom it was so long ago now a year and a half ago oh my god it was a year and a half ago it was really lovely i again filmed that this whole video is just me plugging my other videos yeah it was so nice uh except for there was a fire i don't know if there was actually a real fire but the fire brigade came and we all had to evacuate which was kind of annoying cut the night short and then after that we went to a club, everyone went to this club, and worst club, worst clubbing experience that ever happened in my life. Oh, actually, I lied. I, I was kicked out of that club as well because the bouncers accused my best friend and my boyfriend of going into the toilets together and doing something. So they kicked all three of us out. Um, obviously, they weren't in the bathroom together. I think I was in the bathroom with Summer, but we were in the men's toilets, so they kicked us out. Honestly, I can't really remember, but they were so rude. <laughs> as nice as it was at the beginning of the night, it, it did kind of go a little bit downhill. Um, and then something else happened, and I got really upset about that. And the more I think about it, the more I realise it actually wasn't as good of a night as I thought it was. But it was my prom, so we're going to remember the good parts. Um, and the photos are cute, so your favourite holiday... My favourite holiday would have to be, well, Bali if it happens, <laughs> probably going to be my favourite. Um, we went to the Maldives as a family ages ago now, but I'll insert some photos, you can see how much younger I am. I think I'm like 14 in this, I can't remember. That was beautiful, I would love to go back there. Or we went to Zanti in 
summer of 2019 and we stayed in the Pelagoni Club. If you've heard of it, then you'll know how nice it is. It's absolutely beautiful and I would live there if I could. We were actually going to try and get a job there in our gap years. Obviously, that didn't happen. So maybe that... Right, so we've had first day of uni and now we're going to do first day of school. Um, I really highly doubt I've got a photo of my first day at primary school. So we'll do a photo of my first day at secondary school. My hair, I mean... Here it is. I don't know why my mum did that with my hair. Do I look similar? And then my last day of school. So this was, well obviously we had our exams. So it was kind of, our last day of school wasn't like the last time I went into school when I did my A-levels, still felt like I was at school. But this is our official last day of school. I got loads of photos. We dressed up as prisoners, me and my friends. My whole year pretty much in the morning at like 7 a.m. went to the park and we were just drinking in the park and just playing music before we had to start school. It was a great day. It was actually a really, really lovely day. Anyways, I've been filming for quite a long time now and I need to get editing because uh, I'm on a tight schedule here. So I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up subscribe if you aren't already there's better content coming i promise i think i say that every week but i do mean it i love you i hope you've had a great day and i'll see you next week with another video bye